hello to everyone yes i know many people have difficulties they don't understand how to download or how to check their taxpayers identification number and how to uh, subsequently download the attestation uh, form yes so many people do not know and i'm making this short video in order to show you how to do it all you need is your mobile phone and internet connection that's all so let me just get started the uh, first thing i'm going to open my browser so this is it i'm using google chrome so i open my browser this is what i have then right up here i'm going to type uh, impo.cm uh, this is what i have you can see it right up here this is what I type on the browser. So I'm going to search. So it takes me to the to the website. This is the website. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'll open the the menu. There's a menu at the side here. Let me show you. This is it here. So you are going to click on this three dots three lines in order to open the menu so i'll go ahead and click on it uh, here's the menu next thing i'm going to open services i think in french is service so i'm going to click to open it so this is it here there are many services so i'm going to click on tele declaration you can see it right down here let me show you Tele declaration this is it so i'm going to click on it so click on tele declaration so it takes me to this page here so one thing you need to know is that here if i have my tax uh, taxpayers identification number already i can just click on this option this option to to download it using my taxpayers identification number but i don't have it yet so i'm going to search for it so i'm going to scroll down again and you can see the option tax uh, tele declaration again so i'm going to open it i'm going to click on it so it takes me to this uh this uh this this uh this page so uh you can see some options right up here but I'm, I'm going to click on the first one on this first one so i'm going to click on it that's a uh, consulter le fichier de contribuable i'll click on it so it has taken me to this uh this page depending on your category depending on your category you are going to select one option from the list from this line this line you are going to select one option there so as for me i'm going to select this option that says salarié et organisme so that's the option i'm going to select so i'll click right there i'll click here good you see there's a red line uh, on salarié et organisme meaning is the option i've selected now you can see different fields here the first one is where you can input your tax identification number but yes, I assume that I don't have it or I don't have it yet. So I'm going to click on the second field and then I type my name. I'll put it in the form bar. Now the name you type here matters a lot. If I type Betran, I know that there are many people who are called Betran. And I'm sure in this system, there are many people, uh, many identification numbers owned by people uh called betran something like that so i'm going to put the name that is somehow unique it's difficult to find people with a name deformba so that's the name i'm going to use in order to search when i type in the form bar i i'll click on this uh, option here this button that says affiche i'm going to click on it in order to to see if there is a an an uh an option or if there is a a document in this uh, system owned by somebody called the form so i'll click on it affiche 
yes i click on it so it's loading it's searching the system now you can see there's an option you can see in the form but the transaction now here you can see my taxpayer identification number and uh, many other things not necessary so what my interest here is i just copy the the identification number the next thing is to download the attestation the document so what i would do is normally if i like i can just type info again search the website again if i don't want to complicate things i can just say let me search the website again now that i have my taxpayers identification number next thing i'm going to click on service again like we did last time then uh, i open service i click on delay declaration just like we did now i'm going to scroll down you see this is tele declaration this is it and you can see telecharge uh, tele declare but now uh like i was telling you initially uh, if you have your taxpayer's identification number already you can just click on this tele declare in order to 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 have some options to download so that's what i'm going to do i'll click on tele declare uh here i will click on this option verify and uh, n n e u n i u i'll click on this option this one here so i'll click on it good when i click on it you see they are asking me to input my number tax identification number i'm going to paste it then i click on the button search you can see it here I'll click on that button to search so I'll click on it you see it has everything displayed already you can see my name and other details but what I'll do is I'll click on this edit attestation so I'll click on it so you can see this is the form already this is the attestation form you can see is it already so what I have to do is simply to download it. You see, I'm going to zoom. If you look at up here, you see a button to, you can click in order to download, in order to print it. So you can see this is the button. You can click on this in order to, to download. So I'm clicking on it. So it's now asking me to input the name of the file. So I can just say uh, tax. What's this? tax identification number i can just put the name like that and i click on download and that's all thank you